have a Kazemi, but he's going retrograde. It's like he's getting into the heart of the sun, but he's walking backwards in a sense. Yes. And so, and, and going backwards in a place that he's like kind of unfamiliar with. And so it just feels like it's just bound for like physical comedy. <laughs> you know, he's like bound to trip up at this point. Yeah. But um, there's like a, there's, there's a, 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 a lightness to it um, right before he goes back in again. And yeah, I mean, he will be trining, uh, I mean, at the Kazemi point, you know, he's trining the moon and Uranus and Jupiter and whole sign and, um, and then sextile pretty close to Saturn there. So it, it does seem like he's talking to uh, a lot of the other planets. And then when he goes back into Sagittarius, then he'll be in that whole sign square. He'll be averse to these, but um, it does seem like he's, he's engaged. And then once he goes through, you know, turns direct and goes back through, he's going to speed through Sagittarius pretty quickly after that. Yeah. It's like he's going to have that burst of energy, that empowerment. Um, and for us, he's traveling back over degrees that he's been through already. So he's redoing stuff that we've already looked at. So mm -hmm. it's it's like um, reversals and 